27 storm track weather with Chief Meteorologist Cameron Hopman. Well, that's not too shabby, right? Plenty of sunshine, higher pressure dominating the Great Lakes. Essentially, it was sitting over Lake Superior yesterday. It has now shifted further off to the southeast. And as a result, we're still dealing with those clear skies here at home. But you can see some of that rainfall edging ever closer to our area. For now, however, the skies above southern Wisconsin looking very clear and very comfortable. They are looking over our Constellation camera. Some light, hazy clouds out there. But for the most part, dry, clear, beautiful conditions across the region. Winds right now from the southeast, seven miles per hour. And again, that's because that high pressure system sitting over the Great Lakes spins clockwise. So it's bringing nice southeasterly winds into our area. 71 degrees. We topped out 72 earlier on. And if you want to get out this evening, maybe head on out to the terrace or just grab a bite to eat. It's going to be beautiful. You missed out on your chance yesterday to enjoy that beautiful weather. You get one tonight and then you get another on Friday as well. 68 degrees, your temperature at 7 o'clock. We do see temperatures dip towards 61 degrees by 9 p.m. under those clear skies. We pick your future track up at around uh, 10 o'clock in the evening. 58 degrees in Madison by then. There's your southeasterly winds again doing their job, keeping things nice and mild. But the clear skies overnight tonight into early tomorrow morning, allowing those temperatures to take a little bit of a tumble. Notice some light clouds filtering back into the region. Again, that higher pressure system continues to inch further off to the east, loosening its grip on our area. However, we're still looking at a pretty decent night ahead as temperatures only dive back down to the mid to upper 40s for most of us early tomorrow morning. So it's the final day of the work week. You get that first cup of coffee in you on Friday morning. What about for the remainder of the morning? 51 at 7. By 8 o'clock, we're right around 57 degrees. We fast forward to our lunch hour. We're already pushing the mid 70s. Look at those winds now in from the south. And they will be gusting as high as 5, 10, 15 miles per hour at times. So southerly winds driving temperatures higher. We're up to around 76 degrees around 2 o'clock in the afternoon. Few light clouds moving back in, but all in all, an absolutely beautiful Friday with high temperatures reaching up towards 77 degrees in Madison. I wouldn't be surprised to maybe see an 80 degree temperature tomorrow, but we'll see a much greater chance of 80 degrees once we reach out towards Sunday. 77 your high temperature again on Friday winds from the southeast 5 to 10 miles per hour, but rain is on the horizon. This is 10 o'clock in the evening on Friday. Look at that rainfall to our southwest. That's another low pressure system that's going to churn just to the south of us, bringing chances of rainfall as early as our Saturday morning. What I will say the latest model data actually keeping that system a little further to the south. So it looks like Rock Green counties, Walworth County, Jefferson County, maybe parts of Dane County most affected by that rainfall on Saturday morning. By Saturday afternoon, we're back up into the mid to low 70s and folks Madison Mallard the Madison Mallards back in town at the Duck Pond. They take on the Lakeshore Chinooks on Saturday at 605. It should be a perfect evening for a ball game. 70 degrees at uh, first pitch right around 67 degrees around that seventh inning stretch. By the end of that game, we're seeing temperatures close to 64 degrees. So beautiful weather throughout your Saturday evening. Sunday right now looking primarily dry, partly cloudy and 80. Monday still watching chances of showers, thunderstorms, maybe the threat of stronger storms on Monday uh, morning, Monday afternoon. So we'll watch that closely. Good night for the game you know, tomorrow. It is going to be beautiful. Are you live tomorrow somewhere? I'm live tomorrow. The game is on Saturday. Don't okay. show up okay. to the duck pound on Friday. <laughs> <laughs> you know, uh, you got it wrong. I no. messed that up. Yeah, no. Uh, <laughs> they're, they're taking the field on Friday. Yeah. I am out uh, in Verona tomorrow. Yeah. Hometown days. Yeah. Yes, All right, Cam.